Heaths and heathers are some of my favorite plants. Number one, they're deer proof, which is big in my garden. And number two, they are interesting year round. When the plant goes out of bloom, it will have a long section after these flowers, now that they faded, then they'll fall off. And the new growth it will start from the very tip and we'll have a big blank section of stem that won't have any foliage on it. It makes the plant be, uh, looks untidy, it gets long, lanky, and can flop down. In order to keep heathers and heaths looking their best is right after they finish blooming, they need to be pruned to have the old flower stalks taken off. It's really simple to do. You can do it according to what the plant needs to be shaped nicely. I like to start at the top of the plant and I go typically, oh, just an inch or so below the old bloom stalk. That keeps the plants nice and compact. It's not a very complicated task to keep Heather looking good, and you only have to trim them once a year, so the amount of time that it takes, well, we really shouldn't begrudge our time to our plants. I've got several Heathers to get to work on here. I do love the plants dearly, and to me, they're one of the most worthwhile landscape plants. This is Stan Mapolsky, the Road Gardener.